And so this is the uh, DX Lube Crystal Set 01. Oh yeah, of course. You know, this is a Crystal series uh, going to be introduced more and this is the uh, first one, okay? So we already did the demonstration, the two, actually the three, including a uh, you know, uh, exclusive one. But these two, Taro Crystal and Ginga Crystal was, it was, you know, these all came with the uh, gyro. However, this, the DX Lube Crystal set comes with the four of them. Ultraman G the Primitive, G the Primitive Crystal, Seven Crystal, Black King Crystal, the Kaiju one, and Grugio Born Crystal. Another one, Kaiju, okay? So we'll take a look at this one here, okay? Uh, all right, so we'll see. So first, let's open. Okay. So, go on. There you go. All right. Okay, I think it's open now. All right, so this time the uh, this uh, plastic case kind of have a you know thickness like this. Maybe due to the uh, the you know uh, structure of these metals. I mean not the metals, the crystals. Crystals. Oh, <laughs> that's how you how they installed it. <laughs> okay, so here's the one. How they? How they? How do I get this one out? Oh, from the front. So first we need to just close this. <laughs> this is something new, okay? To get that items out, we need to cro <laughs> we need to install that these all of the thorns. There you go. How's that? Okay, and there you go. All right, so these are, huh? So let's take a look at them. So this is the, uh, which one was it? Uh, G, the primitive crystals. Okay, let me change that on my camera. So I don't like that color here. Maybe this one is better. There you go. Okay. A little bit more lights. Okay, so this is the uh, primitive one. And I'm not sure what the kanji character they have it. Uh, we will see about that. Okay, primitive one. In the back. All the thorns are red color. Okay. Oh, uh, have you noticed that, you know, around the, the older Ultramans, uh, you can see the older Ultra language, which we do not understand. Okay. All the Ultra signs, or what should I say, uh, you know, installed. And now here, the Ultra 7, 7 Crystal, okay? And the Kanji character, I can see that this is the uh, uh, Braid, Braid, you know, because the, he used the, the Ice Rugger, okay? So, interesting. And the color of the thorn is, uh, those are kind of snow white, right? Seven crystal. Next, Brack King. I don't know why he has the name King, <laughs> but Brack King. Okay, there you go. Um, I don't. Well, maybe uh, it has to see. Had to read that kanji there. Simple one. But, oh, I guess I can see that. And now it's it's a power, chikara power. 
Okay, so he has the power, I guess. And the uh, color is green here for the Black King Crystal. Next, yeah, this is the actually the first a uh, first uh, Louvre Kaiju uh, in ap ap appeared in the episode. Guruzio Born, Guruzio Born, Crystal. Kanji character is kind of complicated. So it kind of has to see that from here. Oh no, I can see it. It's me. It, the kanji character, Ma. It's a devil. Devil. Or should I say evil? This is that kanji, uh, the same, uh, actually, you know, uh, same crystal that I used in the show, the first episode, to summon the kaiju, uh, Gurujio Born. Okay. All right. So these uh, see, these uh, three and uh, four crystals. Let's use this one here. Okay. And let me just put that. Okay. More power. Power the one. All right, so let's try that. And first we go with here, All right? Ultraman G, G the primitive crystals. And here we go. Let's try that. And now we have two. We use that uh, first one, the one with the uh boss uh, no bull this is for the bull style okay here we go So that was the uh, G primitive and the single thong bull. All right. Let's try this one here uh, for the power uh, at his attack. Okay, so this was the uh, primitive. I can use that two thorns now. Losso. Okay, now I can see the kanji characters means in the means fight. Fight inside. Okay, I understand that the basically the both of the sounds are same. Okay, so either one or two thorns, and looks like uh, the same sounds. Okay, but however, with the two thorns, the instruction says the uh, only the red color is activated. Let me let, let me just take a look. But you know, it says the lead color, but I can see the slightly the blue as well. But it says with a single thorn, 
bull and two colors let's see to tell but it looks like you know more like I had a red and blue color both of them with the single font okay now let's try the uh, ultra seven the seven crystals start with single thorn maybe and the color should be white and blue Okay, it's a pretty simple Henshin sound. Now try with the uh, two thorns. With Rosso. Rosso style. This time, kind of color is white and red. Sometimes I can see the blue too. Okay, so it's kind of you know, I don't know, hard to tell, but for now, but what that, that's what the instruction says. Okay, next, let's go for the Akaiju one now, and with the here, Black King one. Okay, and single one. Oh no, there's no ones, no singles, okay. Kaiju crystal wa tsuno tenkai sesu ni shiyoshimasu, okay. The instruction says that, you know, uh, for the kaiju crystals, you do not have to open that any of the other uh, thorns. Even though they have the thorns. I don't know, <laughs> okay, what is that difference? But let's, let me just try that without any thorns. See what's gonna happen. Okay, it says Brock Cooking. Okay, so you heard that the Kaiju's war, right? And so, well, the instruction says you don't need to open uh, the thorns, but the, uh, let's see what's going to happen. <laughs> I guess it's the same, right. The instruction is right. Okay, so let's go with the last one. Uh, this is the uh, Grugio Born. Okay, so without any thorns. Let's try that. So Guzio Bonds. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. And then uh, well, I guess you know these days the Ultramans, even that the common lighters, uh Henshin uh, devices are comes with the their Henshin sounds, or sometimes if that they are kaijus or roar. Alright. 
So that's understandable, okay? And now uh, I was looking at the uh, the instructions as the, uh, uh, with the DX lube slugger, which is the, uh, you know, the weapons. And looks like, as, you know, they use that special, uh, these, you know, uh, crystals has the uh, special functions to activate the different colors. So for example, like a wizard lube slugger and here, seven, okay? So with the seven, with the two thorn. Okay, let me just open this one here. Well, lube slugger has not yet released, okay? So this weapon is has not been released. Well, we're doing the pre-orders pretty soon, I guess. And now, the uh, if you have this, you can activate that these, you know, uh, white light on the, the slugger, okay? So to enjoy that more of the lube slugger, and you you can this is the kind of key to activate the special color. That's kind of interesting because it's a it's a uh, ultra seven. He uses the ice slugger and the lube slugger, the similar weapons. Okay. All right, so that's how it works. And also, crystal uh, henke. So, and with the single thorn, with the uh, this lube slugger, we can activate a different sound as well. Huh? The same color, the white color, but the thin shot to slugger. I know, sorry, wide shot slugger. With this style, wide shot slugger and two thorns. Yep, yep. It says the double emerium edge. Double emerium edge. Okay, so that's that kind of, you know, bonus <laughs> prey, I guess. All right, so this is it. And these are the older uh, keys. I mean, not a key, the crystals. Oops, sorry. There you go. And comes with us four of the special. Uh, there you go. Okay, the kaiju one has also comes with it. Okay. All right. So thank you very much for watching these videos. And then, uh, this uh, lube crystal set zero one is already in our store as a pre-orders. So those of you who are interested in uh, getting it, and then, uh, please try that. And uh, if you know, even that pre-orders, you know, uh, went out of the stock, and we can ask our wholesalers for the second wave and so let me hear that you are you know advice on this one okay we didn't you know because we were hesitated with the, this new ultra machines we we really didn't order a lot okay as a first wave so it, it, it you know it's really depending on your request so uh you know maybe we should go for the second wave or third wave even all right so thank you very much, everyone. This has been the live recording from CS Storage International, and, and I will we'll move on to the next 